I'm the manager of Green Street. In Green Street, we show the products that come out of SPIN project, our sustainable product innovation project funded by Switch Asia program. We also incubate the innovative ideas and design our sketches. And this is also the place where the potential customer and the uh, sustainable producer meet. For Green Street, the concept was to have a kind of curbside visibility to bring the products to the, to the consumers and also actually not only to the consumers but a lot of organizations um, can visit there and, and can feel and touch the, the products to take it out of the campus and the industrial uh, situation and bring it into the, into the center of life, literally in Hanoi. is aiming at developing the sustainable product, which is the bridge between consumption and production that make the society to move or to switch to the better and more sustainable pattern of consumption and production. In this film, we are going to introduce to you three products that depict the typical way of development of the sustainable product in our project. This is a very good example about switching from the normal uh, pattern of the production into the more sustainable uh, production uh, technology. This is a very uh, traditional uh, material. We call it the coiling bamboo. Normally, we have to dip the bamboo inside the water for from three months to seven months and that create a lot of water pollution and eutrophication. Uh, for us, we developed the technology, we call it zero waste technology, that takes just a few hours to treat the material. So we save a lot of time, money, working condition, and no waste. And also in here, you see that this is the way we also have the people in the craft villages with the uh, new innovation uh, for the design. So the traditional material and traditional uh, skills, but the different way of making by production and also the different shape of the product. So the coiled bamboo products that we have been working on, uh, we also looked with our design experts from Europe, especially on the user side. So what is the, uh, the need from the user side for this kind of product? How should it look? How should it feel? It looks now much more natural than the products which are on, on the market. It is actually natural. The, the process is much cleaner now and you want to communicate that message as well in the way the product feels and looks. this product, um, the pattern is a Thai ethnic you know, traditional pattern and with a bright black and white color. Ms. Hong, um, who is the pin designer, and she supported us uh, to devise 60 uh, different uh, design. I work with the Hua Pan Plus. We visit them and we see that they produce a lot of the product, different color, they didn't follow any trend and even they didn't bring the, the value of the control into that and even they have a lot of waste of material and they didn't use and they put into the outside uh, to the environment. Okay. So this is a gasifier. Uh, how it works? Very simple. We just put the uh, 
pellet or the fuel inside this what we call reactor and then we set fire on that after about one minute we start having the syn gas and then we put this one up and start cooking very you know, very simple With the results of, of SPIN, um, we have created a better supply of more sustainable products. Not only for export markets and uh, uh, high-end markets, but also for middle class and, 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 and bigger market uh, uh, groups here in Vietnam as well. I think we should continue with this kind of work, but what is needed next to this will be the consumption side, so to look at the demand side. And also what is needed and where we touched upon with our policy studies is the role that the government plays in pushing for green products and green consumption.